Hey guys, is your computer driving you insane? Because mine is driving me insane. Uh, if you're like me, you have a lot of things open, and then once you get into the Google Meet and you share a screen, you're pretty much at a crawl and your fan is going full blast. Uh, and that's a huge pain by the end of the day. Now I'm on a Mac, uh, but this should work on your computer as well if you're on your work computer. Basically, Google Chrome hogs a lot of memory and there are certain processes in Google Chrome that do this so I'm going to show you how to disable the process that is the biggest culprit. So what you'll do is you will go over to the right side here at the top the three dots and you're going to go down and click on settings and that will bring you here. What you'll do is click privacy and security on the left side here and you want to click Site Settings. Scroll down. Click on Additional Permissions under Permissions. And this is what you want, this plugin access. So unsandbox plugin access. You'll see this is already in gray for me. For you, it's going to be blue like this, though. Um, and then that's what you want to turn off. It's loading a bunch of plugin processes, um, and that's what's slowing everything down. So if you turn that off, that should be fine. It shouldn't cause you any issues at all. If it does, you can go back in here and turn it back on, but I haven't had any problems. I doubt you will. All right, this is really nerdy, but important, so bear with me. At the bottom of the screen, you'll see my memory pressure, and that is in green, and that's good. Green means good in this case. Ever since I started using Chrome at the beginning of the school year, it has been in yellow and sometimes red, which is not good because my computer is at a crawl and barely functioning when it's at red. Today it dipped below uh, three gigabytes being used for the first time since the start of the school year, and it's been steady ever since. So that means it worked. And if it works for you, let me know. If you have any trouble, let me know, and I'll try to help you out a little bit further.